rat cook. No. Who's he? Just a cook in the Night's Watch. He was angry at the king for something I don't remember. When the king was visiting the Nightfall, the cook killed the king's son, cooked him into a big pie with onions, carrots, mushrooms, and bacon. That night, he served the pie to the king. He liked the taste of his son so much, he asked for a second slice. The gods turned the cook into a giant white rat who could only eat his own young. He's been roaming the night fort ever since, devouring his own babies. No matter what he does, he's always hungry. If the gods turned every killer into a giant white it rat... It wasn't for murder the gods cursed a rat cook or for serving the king's son in a pie. He killed a guest beneath his roof. That's something the gods can't forgive. You're not one of mine, are you? No, my lord. Didn't think so. Too pretty. <laughs> Where are my damn moron sons? Black Walder and Lothar promised to be here by midday. They're here, my lord. Well, what are they doing? Trimming their cunt hairs? Tell them to come here, now. But they're already here, my lord. Here, my lord. They weren't easy to carve, especially Black Waldo. My name is Arya Stark. I want you to know that. The last thing you're ever going to see is a Stark smiling down at you as you die. You're wondering why I brought you all here. After all, we just had a feast. Since when does old Walter give us two feasts in a single fortnight? <laughs> well, it's no good being Lord of the Riverlands if you can't celebrate with your family. That's what I say. I've gathered every fray who means a damn thing, so I can tell you my plans. 
for this great house now that winter has come. But first, a toast. No more of that Gornish horse piss. This is the finest arbor gold. Proper wine for proper heroes. Stand together. Wasting good wine on a damn woman. Maybe I'm not the most pleasant man. I'll admit it, but I'm proud of you lot. You're my family. The men who helped me slaughter the Starks at the Red Wedding. Yes. Yes. Cheer. Brave men. All of you. Butcher the woman pregnant with her babe. Cut the throat of a mother of five. Slaughtered your guests after inviting them into your home. But you didn't slaughter every one of the Starks. No, no. That was your mistake. You should have ripped them all out, root and stem. Leave one wolf alive and the sheep are never safe. people ask you what happened here, tell them the North remembers. Tell them winter came for House Frey. 